I decided this morning to show you real life. <laughs> this is how I came down this morning. This is what I have in my hands. This is everything I came down from my bedroom with. My camera, my phone, my water bottle, and my laundry. But let me get <laughs> a little cleaned up. Also, I'm wearing my tank top because I am determined, even though it's 11 o'clock and I slept until 10, that I am gonna go on a walk today because Jason surprised me and he's home today. I didn't know he was staying home or I would have gotten up at seven when he actually woke me up. <laughs> I don't know why he was awake at seven if he wasn't going to work. But anyway, let me get a little bit cleaned up here and start a load of laundry and then well, I'll come back. did my hair it's as much as I'm gonna get ready right now but I just came in my room because I need to work on the computer really quick while that load is washing Jason is out running errands he's depositing his paycheck and washing his car when he gets home we're gonna go wash my car and go for a walk so but I love coming into my room into my little craft room here if any of you are new this is like Grand Central Station in here now this was not here when I went to bed last night I, I know for a fact it wasn't here. I also know that my daughters, my younger two, Chelsea and Ashley, set an alarm this morning, got up, got their chores done, not all the way, mind you, before they went out to play this morning because their friend has limited time to play, and then I think we're gonna try and go to a movie this afternoon. But in the meantime, I think Chelsea was waiting for Ashley to wake up, and this is what I found. This is why I have a craft room, and this is why I have their side so that they can be creative. I mean, she's painting a witch hat because she found one, and so she started painting it. I don't know what else she painted. I think she did something else. I don't think it was just this. There's only pink on that side. Maybe she did her little bottle caps. I don't know where she puts them. I want to show you guys. That's a craft bucket, so I don't know if she just was looking in there for something to paint. She did something. There's paint all over these brushes, so I don't know what else she painted, but I love my kids, and I love that they're creative, and I, I look at this chair. <laughs> she obviously got it on her hand. I don't care. I do mind that she comes back to clean it up, but I don't mind that she got it out. That's what all of this is for, like for them to be creative and get off their iPads and have fun. I was just talking about that with my dad last night. Um, he, he suggested finding something for my daughter Abby to do mentally, like some kind of a project or something that she can do from bed while her back hurt, um, something for her to listen to, something for her to like, do with her fingers, something to kind of keep her mind off of the pain. And crafting like this is totally up her alley. I just need to find something that she can do laying down. It's kind of tricky, but anywho, I'm going to get um, yesterday's video finished editing really quick. I think I fell asleep it yesterday evening on the couch. Actually, I know I did. <laughs> didn't think I did. I intentionally laid down and I woke up when Jason got home from work and then was up for a couple hours, but I didn't end yesterday's video. So I'm going to go finish editing that really quick and get that loaded and then um, Jason should be home. All right, we are gonna go and get my car washed and then we're gonna go for a walk. I had him change into just a little bit of workout clothes, right? Changed. He didn't wear like, how can you wear those? Because this is sufficient. Okay. I'm not gonna get like super sweaty or anything. No, we're not. I just didn't want to wear two t-shirts, so I, I know. it as it breathes better. It's probably really noisy with that window open. Yeah. We're, so I guess we're gonna, we'll go to the lake here. That'd be kind of nice. Oh, I want to be in the sunshine. Yeah, I want to be in the sunshine. Oh, all right. Is that not okay? I just don't want to go back to the other side of the town. So, we'll figure out where we're gonna go for a walk after we do the car. Now that I'm looking back, I can see all the signs I tried to fill in the cracks that were spread in my mind. But I was all out of hope, lost in an endless maze. The emptiness had afforded. Like a vibe, you broke the 
but I'll let you have control. <laughs> I had the brush while, while he was getting the foam set up through the sprayer, and then he thought he could have the brush. No, and, I was uh, just telling you, like, you need to go do this or do that. He had a hard time letting me have control of it for as long as I did. <laughs> Um, but now I have a problem. My feet are wet and I have socks and walking shoes to put on. So I'm going to like get them set out, out in the sun for a second. But that was kind of nice to get the car all cleaned up. It feels so good to have sun on us. It's supposed to be like 84 tomorrow and 89 on Sunday and 91 on Monday. The problem is I don't like coming down to the beach on those days because it's on Saturdays because it's so crowded. It's so crowded and especially on a hot day like that, like one of the first ones. So it's like, I'm all geared up, wanna to go to the beach and sit there and hang out and chat with my girlfriends and stuff, but not when the rest of the town is there. So I have to wait, but it's nice to be here with you. Thanks for coming. Yeah, it's nice. Sorry this one isn't as shaded as he wanted. He was kind of going for the less sweat equity kind of a walk, but. I'm feeling good. I'll probably go for a run later. So pretty though. So um, nice. But I need sunshine. I need Did to you get... set your little app? Are you trying to track I it? I don't have my phone. I left my oh. phone at home. Good thing you're here to talk you to. You sure? It's not sitting in the seat there or something? I didn't have it the whole time I was there. In okay. the car. Alright. So, right. oh, I can see those bugs. Oh. There's no way you guys are going to be able to see them on camera. But we're just going through a huge gnat cloud. So if you guys want to learn a Washington term, when the mountain's out, that's what it means. When you can see Mount Rainier from like what? How many miles away is Mount Rainier? Oh, I'm zoomed in too. We're, we're a long ways away. We're a long ways away. Yeah. So when the when you when someone says the mountain's out, it means the skies are blue, there's no clouds, and you can see Mount Rainier. Yeah. See right here. You, oh, there you can see the white tip. A little bit of Washington trivia for you. Mountains out. Um, Abby always tries to take a picture of Rainier when we're going to all of her appointments. We need, we need to go to it with the kids. Go to, around I know, it. We I know. We have to climb it, but we can go around it. It's amazing. Yeah. I also realized these walks all need to end in a bathroom. I can even while in without having a problem. I have. I was thinking this morning, I'm like, you know you're in your 40s when you wake up at 6 a.m. to go to the bathroom regardless of an alarm. And now apparently, <laughs> apparently you can't go on a walk for more than a mile or two without needing a restroom. So, welcome to our mid-40s. You're in your late 40s, sorry. You're on your way out. <laughs> I just found out where we might be on July 2nd. There's a firework show. We haven't ever seen one do have it here at the lake. That's kind of fun. We also haven't seen a backup for boats in quite a while. So that's kind of fun that people are getting out on the lake. Home, I'm starting to pull out some of this 4th of July stuff before I get showered up. Look at our babies. Oh, that one's a fun one to have. I'm trying to decide what to bring out. I don't want to do a ton because it's literally the 4th of July in like a week. Okay, got a few things. Let's see what I can do. All right, out here on my front porch, I just have a little lantern next to the other lantern. I need a third piece to go here. And then I've got my little garland. It actually lights up, so it'll be cute at night. And then I need to clean up back there. I'm running out of time right now. But I just did a little display right here, again with another lantern, and my little pot that I keep my hose in, and my flag. 
And then I put this flag out here, and I've got my pinwheels. If you remember, I put the pinwheels out earlier this week. Okay, I don't have much time left, but I have done my little um, garland here, and then I've got a little stack of blocks for a flag there. And this is kind of my favorite so far. I like my little um, display right here. Um, I need another item or two on this little thing here, but I don't want it to get too cluttered. And I might need to kind of scoot those over together, but I do like that. That's really fun. All right, but I don't actually have time to do more than that. I'm kind of like totally motivated to do more, but I need to shower real quick and take Chelsea to a movie. She's just has it in her head. Today is the day she wants to go. Oh, looks like Jason's gotten a lot done up here. Yeah. <laughs> Guess what? That's what it looks to have a day off. I'm gonna shower real quick. I don't look much better, but I feel much better. And he's fully in position. I'm laying down. Have a good nap. Hello. All right, what movie are we gonna go see? Uh, the Buzz Lightyear. One. Lightyear, right? Yeah. Are you excited, Ash? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm having an allergy attack. It started when I was on the trail. It's part of the reason why I'm. Actually, it's all the reason why I'm not wearing makeup anymore. Like I didn't. It's also the reason why I didn't put makeup on because I'm my eyes are watering. I keep sneezing. My nose is running. You're just gonna wipe it all off. I'm just gonna wipe it all off, and it's warm out here. I'm just gonna sit in a dark theater, so it doesn't matter. But I also might have plans tonight with my girlfriends, and I don't remember if I do. We have a friend who's kind of gotten priced out of her. Well, she's getting kicked out of her home because it's being sold. Um, she was just renting it, but also. Yeah, there's nothing on the calendar, but I thought that they were going to do something. And that, like, you can't rent anything or buy anything here. It's so high. The market is too high, so she's priced out. So she has to move to Texas. And we're all so sad. Did you know that? Who? Dallas and their family. Oh. I know. See? That's not fun. I know. So we're sad to see them go, but I got to find out tonight. It might be a full day for me and I might actually need to put makeup on if I do girls night. I might actually have to get more ready. Not, I, I won't get more dressed, but I might actually have to get my makeup on. Cause I don't like to go out like that when I don't have makeup on. Yeah, they have their trunk open? Okay. Hang on. Flash, we refilled the drink with strawberry lemonade. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Um, let's did you like some Yeah, let's do. But did you like the show? Yeah. Take this off. It's too hot. I can't. Oh, there's not anything underneath it? Why did you do that? It's like 75 degrees outside. We have not gotten accustomed to the warm weather. Nope. Um we're gonna run really quick over to Bath and Body Works because what? because they have a sale on lotion and they were out of stock. <laughs> on my favorite kind at our location. And we're like two minutes away from another one here. Well, that's where the store used to be, and it's not there now, so. That means we gotta go somewhere. No, now we go somewhere else. Back at home, and I have done a few more things with the 4th of July stuff I just wanted to show you. It's pretty cute. So we're a little bit late in the game, but it really truly just feels like summer just barely started. So it's still appropriate. And I'm gonna keep it up through probably the end of July-ish. Probably the week after, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how long I keep it up. I don't like red very much, but I love it during the summer. So let me just show you the, all of it that I've done. All right, so here is the whole shelf again. I have the little flag blocks. I added a little star. I added my little fl flag swag. And then I have this cute little um, banner that I put onto the camper van from the truck. I added Happy Fourth right there. And I pulled out a little truck from the shelf and added a little banner to him as well. I just taped it to the truck. All right, in here I actually just added a few things inside my jar. I have a little cup with straws in it and then that little anchor and a small red anchor. And then I just kind of folded in this, I actually probably should put the 
straws going the other direction. So you can see them when this is tucked right here. Put that on there. I don't know. I'm still kind of playing with it. I don't really, oh, maybe I can do that. Stars and stripes. But again, you do it in odds. So I need something else to go right here. Okay, then on this little tiered stand, I haven't finalized it yet. I don't know. I've got a candle and then a little towel here. I like the little fringes on this and then a little salt and pepper shaker. If you want, want to, if you want to find a really cheap way to decorate little tiered stands like this, find salt and pepper shakers because they always come in cute um, shapes and colors. I don't know where the other one is for this guy and why he won't stand up now, but I am going to get some more hydrangeas when they do bloom and put some more on my table, but these are from last year, so they held up pretty good. Then here on my tiered stand on my table, I just kept it pretty simple. I don't know where the other end of this little salt and pepper shaker is, but there's a little camper van. Then I have a little flag hanging out the basket back here and a little star. Then I have a red jar and our little coral. And then I just kind of drape the beads and on the other side over here, I have little 4th of July napkins. I probably got those from Hobby Lobby on clearance last okay, well, year. Well, we asked our kids if they all wanted to go out to dinner together and they all said no. <laughs> Literally, they're like, we'd rather have something from home. Except for Kaylee. She went to, her and Abby and Jacob went to the lake. They probably let, met some other people there. They came home and Kaylee and Jacob went to work out. And she's like, well, we don't, we don't want to eat with you guys, but can you get us Cafe Rio? Oh, crap. Did you just pop out your lens? Yeah. Anyway, it's so she just great. got done at the gym and she called me and she's like, so can you pay for it? Can we? Anyway, so we're going to meet them at Cafe Rio so that we can pay for their Cafe Rio. And then we're going to go find something to eat, but we don't know where. I don't want to be fancy because I don't even have makeup on. Um, I don't care if it's takeout, eat in the car. I just car. Think it's such a beautiful It evening. is a beautiful night. It'd be nice to What if we food? did like Wild Fin and sat outside? You just really want something in Wild Fin, don't you? No, I just don't know where, aside from like Red Robin, I don't think we have time to like go down to Bellevue or Seattle. Okay, okay. I don't know. Anyway, we're gonna figure out where we're gonna go. And then, um, anyway, I'm kind of hoping that Kaylee and Jacob's order from Cafe Rio will give me enough rewards that I can have a free salad next week. <laughs> That's my hope. So we had a great time eating. There was this old couple sitting next to us. They were cute. And they were so cute. They're probably in their 80s. And uh, they were like, what are you guys getting? Sorry to bother you, but what are you guys getting? We see your, your all-in platter. We were, we were thinking about doing that. And it looks amazing. Tell us about it. Have you had it before? And, and then like we got it and... They were just a cute little old couple. They were just a cute couple. Anyway, just... Anyway, it's just kind of fun. So we she came... Was worried about the sun in her eyes and yeah, stuff. It was cute. It was very cute. We'll get there someday. Uh, yeah, 40 years. <laughs> Hopefully we get to that point. Anyway, we just wanted to like say goodnight to you guys. Um, we're gonna go home. And I, I say put our kids to bed. They're, they're, they don't go to bed. Now that it's summertime, they just don't go to bed. It's a beautiful sunset. Yeah, Thanks you for guys, watching, leave you, comments. We got some fun stuff coming up. Oh, and thank you for the kind words about my sister's wedding. That video went up current day today. And um, thank you for your kind words. Um, I will respond to you eventually. We're just enjoying our day today. Um, but I will pass along your kind words to my sister and let her know you guys um, loved her wedding and she was a beautiful bride and we had a great time with her. And we're looking forward to like spending time with her and her new husband and their kids when we go back down next month and hang out with them again. If you guys have any, I don't know, maybe we should do a Q&A coming up sometime because I think we have a lot of new followers. So, Any questions you guys want to ask about anything, we'll we yeah. answer. If we don't like the question, we'll just tell you we don't like that question. <laughs> so. Just ask, you know, we love communicating and connecting with yeah. our viewers. It's, you guys are awesome. Yeah, so if you guys want us to do a Q&A video, leave your question down below. Maybe we can like have enough questions that we can do that. And maybe when we're in Bear Lake or something, we can do a live video with you guys. You guys like that in Hawaii, even though you didn't get to do it with me. Um, yeah, it was no. really fun because you were gone. You were at the urgent care oh, with Chelsea. Oh, urgent care. That's right. And it yeah, was our last right. day, our second to last day. Yeah, I had to take her. Yeah, we are going to do that more when we go back to Hawaii. When When is that, honey? I think about 372 <laughs> days. 
or 372,000 points. That's <laughs> probably how long it's gonna take to be able to go again. But anyway, take care you guys. Leave questions down below if you have them for us and we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. This is where my heart is Oh, you know it's true No matter where I go I'm coming home to you